So um, I did a few videos already now on a 7414 type oscillator chip making some fast edges with different types of, uh, of uh, TTL families, 74 or HC, AC, other types, trying to get a fast edge, comparing them and stuff. And um, so I've done, I've done some videos on that. Um, and the little board I was using was uh, kind of a through hole design and people were pointing out that maybe that's not ideal. If you take a look at the edges that I was getting, we can see that there's a ringing on those edges and that might be due to inductances or bypassing or bad grounds, whatever you want to say. So I thought what we would do is try to build the best one that we could do. So let's do that. Let's try to try to eliminate all those variables. So this is the circuit that I was using. And uh, first of all, I hate the schematics that KiCad had as for the, anyway, they're a Schmidt trigger uh, inverter. Um, and um, so this is the oscillator. It just has a feedback and uh, it just goes round and round and round and round. Uh, I'm gonna buffer that. And then I'm gonna run it into uh, four of those chips with 200, ohm resistors on each one. So you have a total impedance of 50 ohms to the output. All right. And so that will be better. Um, so if we make it small and we put it all on one board, we can control a whole bunch of stuff. Okay. So uh, this is the chip. These are the four these are the four resistors here, and they go right to the output. I tried to keep the length constant. Um, over here is the RC that oscillates. And then here's the VCC pin of the, uh, of the chip. And the VCC is going to come in. It's going to be bypassed by one tantalum and then two ceramics. And then you can choose various frequencies. Um, and so low frequency, mid frequency, high frequency. So I'm gonna put in something like a 4.7 microfarads, a 0.1 and a 0 0.01, you know, something like that uh, to try to give you the best chance of generating a, uh, a good edge. And then uh, the backside will have a pour, all right? And so if we take a look at uh, what this thing's gonna look like, uh, it will have those 200 ohm resistors going into the uh, SMA connector. And uh, yeah, that's what it will look like. Of course, there's MSI dog on the back. He's always around. He's always around. All right. So um, I think this will be a fun board to build and see if we can get better data. <laughs>